Hello everyone, I'm Cryptic Fox, and welcome back to a very rainy day here in Don't Starve Hamlet. Uh, we've been working a little bit on kind of building things up around here. I've got a couple of the, the buildings that I've made, uh, and I, what I would actually really like to do is, is take this whole row here and fill it up with these houses so that I have, or not houses I guess, but storefronts. So I have a really convenient way to run around and do my shopping and stuff. Um, oh, I think my fuel just ran out of, or my fan just ran out of fuel. Uh, so we'll refuel this thing. It does a really nice job of keeping it dry. It's oddly enough, even when it's pouring rain. So no complaints there. Uh, what I want to do today, though, is try to stock up on some oinks. Um, I should probably use this jerky up. So we're going to stock up on some oinks today, and we'll see if, uh, see if we can get a little bit rich. But I also want to go and check on the, uh, the nettle vines that have been growing, so we can try to get some of those. Because I think the season change is going to be coming soon. And when the season change is over... Uh, the allergies and stuff are going to be a bit of an issue. I'm pretty sure my gas mask over here is a little bit worn out, unless I made a new one. Uh, 34%, so it's, it's not exactly going to last a long time. Uh, but we do have a way to, to make a good a good stack of points if we can get that going, so we're going to go check that out. Shut that down for now. Oh, I don't even need this hat on. I'm wearing my hat out. Keep that handy. I don't know what we're going to need just yet, because like I said, I don't know exactly when the season changes over, and that could present some problems, uh, but we are going to need some food at least. Our garden's been growing nicely up, up here, too, so I guess I should grab some vegetables. Uh, we can either make some pierogi out of these, or we can make some vegetable stingers or something to try to help with the sanity. But I do have some uh, some cooked lotus there already. I guess I don't really need to rush too much on the sanity food. Check of berries, though. All right, I'm actually I'm not going to be making any sanity drinks or pierogi for that matter because I don't have any eggs and we don't have any radishes or uh, asparagus. So unfortunately, those are kind of ruled out. That's okay. Uh, we'll take the poop up here. We'll get these fertilized so our bushes will grow again. Oh, there's seeds up here. We're definitely going to need those. Replant some more vegetables. They'll come in handy. All right, well, we're fed well enough for the moment. Uh, I, I only have the one weapon at the, at the moment, too, though, I think. I, I need to get some more some more halberds and stuff. So I guess we can, either, we can either defeat a guard and take theirs, which is, I guess, the free way to get it, or we can go buy one. But they're not that expensive to buy. We could also make them, too, I suppose, but it just seems like a waste of iron. Uh, we didn't dig up the, the thief's cache, either. So we're going to go dig that up first. Then we're going to go over here. We'll check out how our plants are growing and see whether we can get any, uh, any nettle off of that. Uh, because we are going to need it for the next season when stuff happens. Uh, and then I think we're going to get just focused on trying to get some oinks so we can try to become a little bit more rich than we are currently. Ah, oh, I just had to start raiding right when I start fighting this guy. Oh. And, of course, that's perfect timing. Oh, no. <laughs> There's a couple more guards than I wanted to deal with. Oh, that's a lot of guards. Okay, let's run. <laughs> Take this and beat a discreet retreat. This is not the weather we want to be fighting those guys in. I mean, multiple guards at any point is really not something we want to mess with. Uh, Alright, well, I can't dig this stuff up until I find some flint, so I guess we're going to have to go flip some rocks. Well, I found the place where we have to dig up the bandit stuff, but unless I find one more flint, I can't actually dig it up. Of all the things I thought I would run out of, flint is really not the one I would have guessed. Plus, we got those little ladybug things. I did steal a pig's pickaxe, so maybe we can find some flint in here. I don't know if these ever drop off flint, though. They do. Good. Okay, perfect. A little bit of gold dust there, too, but I'm not really worried about that. Okay, right, let's go get our shovel made up. And we can use that to dig up the, the thief stuff and see what we have in here. Sometimes they have, like, uh, food and things here, too, like canned tuna and stuff. A couple feathers. Oh, man, a whole bunch of canned tuna. And some oinks. Nice. Probably oinks he took off me earlier. Rotten little dude. Okay, I thought the cans of uh, Balfin Free Tuna. I thought the cans of Balfin Free Tuna would actually stack, but apparently they don't. So that's not so great. Jump across here. All right. Now it's it is pouring rain, so if, with any luck, these things are actually no. I mean, they're, they they look like they're growing, sort of. Uh, does this have any fuel in it? I can't turn it on, so I'm guessing it doesn't have any fuel in it. I, I think I could put wood in it. Come on. Peace. There we go. Turn that on. 
Oh, maybe it was already full. I think it would have just been like a weird mess up with the indicator. Give me more flint. No more flint. There we go. It is it is sprouting. Start to harvest this now. Ah, that's what we're talking about. Give me all these. Come on. I know you got more. You've had all season to grow. Really? Three? Oh, there we go. Four. I take three per netter roll, sadly, so this isn't exactly something we can... Uh, maybe I should put a weapon on this. There you go. Oh, fish! Sweet! What's that for timing? I need my umbrella to stand in here. Okay, well that really sucks. I only managed to harvest from, well, from five of them. So it's at least another five that didn't sprout yet. Sometimes I really wonder what it takes to get these to grow right. They're wet. They should be sprouting, but they're just not. All right. I, they did finally sprout. I got 11 of them. So I guess that's a good start. I'm just going to leave the water on there. We'll refill it later. I, I, I think I put wood in it when I didn't actually need to. That could be worse. Uh, let's get out of here. I don't need my umbrella anymore. Uh, we'll go back to town. I want to try and grab some more supplies and stuff. So the idea is we're going to head over to the... Uh, oh, actually, I could use this. Do I have a hammer? Of course I don't. I left everything back in town. Go me. I really need wood, too. Plus, these guards aren't going to be very happy with me. I hope, hopefully not too many of them are very close. Uh, the idea is we're going to go over to where we found the, uh, the Doomsday Calendar thing. And there's a well in there where we can throw stuff in. Which will spawn shadow monsters, and then we can kill the shadow monsters and use the shadow fuel we get to, to get some gems. The gems, of course, we can sell for like 10 oinks each, so it's a pretty good way to produce some, produce some quick money, I suppose. Uh, I need a place to put my food. Uh, not really a lot of room in here. Let's put the poop in here for now. Uh, we have a seed we can stick in. Nope. Never mind. All right, that's, that's completely full. I think I have one of the gardens up here that's not growing. Yeah, there we go. <laughs> Jeez, these are ready to harvest already. That was fast. All right, we'll just throw some uh, some tuna down here, I guess. These are the gems you got. You get these purple gems. I have three of them already. Uh, I'm going to keep those handy, I guess. We have a lot of oinks already. I already have over 100 oinks. Um, but we, and we definitely need some more pig skins if we're going to make some more of those buildings. But let's... Um, Let's see what the shop has for us. Oh, it's nighttime, so we're gonna have to wait. Uh, I have a fish here I can cook as well, but I think I need two fish to make fish sticks, if I'm not mistaken. Let's find out. Um, fish sticks. A couple filler. I don't know. That's probably just gonna make meatballs or uh, kebabs rather. Oh, right, look, it did make fish sticks. Okay, good. I thought for some reason I thought it took two fish, but I guess one is enough. All right, so we have fish sticks, meatballs. I don't really have much healy food going on here, which isn't great. Uh, jerky, we have a little bit of. I'm gonna take all the jerky. We're gonna need that. Maybe we'll keep the aloe with us too. No, actually, I'll keep the. Uh, I'm gonna keep the lo cooked lotus because we're gonna need to gain some sanity back. There we go. Back to full sanity. Any gears available in here? No gears. And this is why I want to have multiple shops, so we can kind of pop in and see if we can get gears in another one if we can. Um, I'll grab the halberd, I guess. Save time fighting the pigs since I kind of sort of made a few of them mad at me. <laughs> we probably don't want to do that too much. All right. Everything else I guess I can keep with me. And uh, let's go and uh, battle some shadows and see if we can get some fancy, fancy shadow fuel. All right, we're back in the dungeon that had the apocalypse calendar in it, and in here, of course, we have Ends Well, which is apparently a thing, which is pretty much how he describes just about everything in this game. Uh, there were spike traps in this room, but I've, I've taken the liberty of triggering those and smashing them down so we don't have to deal with them. It'll give us the most room to run around in. Uh, I probably should have brought a little more wood so I can have some more light in here. Wasn't entirely thinking about it, but uh, we can put maybe like a fire pit down here. Oh, actually, that lights up things pretty well all by itself. I was going to build more than one, but I think one will probably do. So this is the ends well, and it's pretty much our money-making machine. Uh, we can take stuff and like throw it in here. 
and apparently it won't accept rot, but it will accept things like sticks, it'll accept monster meat, so we can put a monster meat in there. And that'll spawn us some enemies. And it'll hold still long enough. Kill these guys off. Uh, and actually, I should probably even do some good things for my sanity, because every time you kill them, you get some sanity back. So we'll just make a mess out of these. That's going to get us shadow, or nightmare fuel, rather. And then the nightmare fuel, we can take that and throw it into the well. And that spits out random number of gems from, like, one to three. Uh, so far, every time I've done it, I've gotten three out of it. And there's the one. <laughs> so we didn't get so lucky that time, but that's already four gems for one monster meat. We pretty much just... Oh! Got that one straight. That's interesting. That was a monster meat. I got a gem straight for it. That's... I kind of wish I'd brought a whole stack now. Right, this time, we definitely got the monster. Fire pit's not lighting up quite as well as I would like it to. I think I need to actually throw some more wood on it. Ow. There we go. One more nightmare fuel. Uh, actually, I totally meant to put... Uh, we're already fully fed and everything. I meant to put on the uh, suit of armor as well, just to make sure, but... I'm trying to avoid taking any, any unnecessary excess damage if we can. While we farm for... Oh. Alright, this time we got a big one. Terabeek. It's gonna suck when the sword runs out and I have to switch over to using a halberd. Nice. Oops, didn't mean to pick that up. So I'm just gonna keep farming these guys for a bit. We'll get a collection of gems, and then we can trade or uh, uh, collection of nightmare fuel. We'll drop those in to get gems, and then we can take the gems, the gems back to the town. Oops. Trade those in for a whole pile of oinks. We'll be rich. I just broke my halberd. Uh, my sword is gone. My my halberd's toast. I guess we're now on a machete. It's gonna take a little while to kill this terror beak, but once we get this guy down, I guess we'll have enough shadow fuel for now. I, could, I could probably could make a spear, I guess. I just don't. Flint has been kind of a challenge for me lately. All right, so we, we killed a whole bunch of them. Uh, that gets me 36 shadow fuel, or nightmare fuel rather. Just stoke the fire up nice and high. All right, now we just start tossing this in. Let all the gems spew out. What is that in the corner over there? What is that? Oh, I'm just going a little insane. Never mind. Uh, let's grab this. Punch on these. I hope a little bit with my sanity. We'll just start cashing in for gems. All right, well, I cashed in all the, uh, the nightmare fuel, and it looks like we did fairly well for ourselves in terms of gems. This should fetch us a pretty penny or two, I guess. Uh, I'm going to grab all these up. We'll see how many we have. I'm not entirely sure. I mean, I traded in 36 shadow... Uh, nightmare fuel, rather. So, at a, if I was only getting singles, it would only be 36 gems here. I mean, only 36, which is like 360 oinks. But sometimes they come out in triples, and there were quite a few of those. So, I think we're going to do pretty well. We might actually have more than 100 here. Which would be pretty sweet. All right, we didn't clear 100, but we got 85 of them, so that's 850 points worth. Uh, and that really took no time at all. It's pretty sweet. Good way to cash in for some money. Um, all right, we're going to go back. We'll trade in some of these oinks. Uh, I probably should try to make a weapon, but I don't have any... I don't have any flint, so I can't make any weapons. So I guess we'll have to make do with our with machete and hope that... Uh, hope the weather's favorable on the way out of here. Uh, I did use a lot of sticks, so maybe I'll grab a couple of these on the way out. Just in case I lose my lightning charge, I'm probably going to want some sort of a light source. Oh no! Season's changed. We got thorns now. Um, that's a problem. I gotta get back so I can use the, the nettles to make some more nettle rolls. Ugh. A little bit of lag. Oh! My helmet broke. Oh, that is so bad. Oh no, I'm going the wrong direction. Uh, I need to go up. And I went down. That's not good. I don't have any pigskin, so I can't make another helmet. Run, little dude, run! I'm gonna grab this for an extra 10 oinks. Alright, we gotta go up. Up past all this junk. Oh, I hate this season. Oh, 
I don't really have any healing food either. I was hoping I could get some, get some more flint there. I'm desperate for some flint. All right, let's get on this. We can get out of here. Stay away from those flowers. Wouldn't hurt to grab a few of these. Oh, we can actually grab some of these tubers for food too, now that they're flowering. They're good eats. I should grab this nighter for some fuel. I really wish there was some, some flint just laying on the ground right here. That'd be really handy. Oh, speaking of flint, there's some. Perfect. Uh, do I have enough to make another machete? I don't think I do. Run for it! Oh my gosh, I'm in trouble. So we have ladybugs on our heels. I don't have even a machete to work with now. We just have to defend ourselves with a shovel. <sighs> I need to find some more flint. There's two. All right, I can make an axe with that at least. That'll give me something. If we have to hack our way through any vines to get back, though... We're gonna have a bit of a problem because I don't have I don't have enough flint to make a machete. That's gonna be really bad. Alright. Get oh, man, there's a lot. Alright, we gotta get out of here. Alright, I, I got an issue. Uh, I did find enough flint. There was actually one more piece of flint in here I found, so I could make another machete. Uh, we're gonna need that probably to chop our way through through the thorns and stuff, but it's nighttime now. I tried to go outside, and that's probably not a very good idea. Seeing as how there's a whole bunch of ladybugs out there, which I really don't want to mess with. This would not be the time to die when we're running home with a pack full of, well, effectively oinks. We're, we're rich. Gotta get back with the wealth we found. All right, daytime's here. Oh, jeez. Oh, no. No, 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 no. How are they surviving in this? Toxic gas. They shouldn't be able to. Um, I need to go. I need to go up this way. Oh, come on, get out of here! No, 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 no! Don't hit me! Don't hit me! No, no! I really can't afford to fight these guys. Run for it! Run for it! No, don't hit them! That's so bad. Don't hit that thing. I already hit that thing once. Why didn't it break? Oh my gosh, don't kill me now. Don't kill me now. Going a little crazy. I'm also a little injured. Clean up a dung ball, see if there's some more flint in here. Nope, just rocks. Rocks of grass. Man, it's a good thing I had that jerky on me. Alright, we're almost back. Uh, I have... No flint. <laughs> I was gonna say, I can make a new axe so I can get some wood, but I have no flint to work with. All right, we're in the clear. Man, that was that was a little touch and go there. That'd be an awful place to die. Oh, why am I still got this mask on? Get that off of there. Uh, where's my camp? Let's go find my camp. I could use a new football helmet, so I really should make one of those. Uh, I could refuel our fan. The one thing I've noticed about the fan is it doesn't seem to have any kind of an indicator on it showing how full it is. So I never know exactly whether I need to put more fuel in it or not. Okay, so we have all these gems that we're going to need to cash in now. Uh, this rot... No, you ate the seeds. I kind of need those. I still want to get around to making a birdcage. I haven't, still haven't done that yet. So much I want to do. I haven't seen a, a bat wave in a while either, so I should probably be kind of on the lookout for one of those. All right, well, we're all restocked on sticks and everything. I grabbed some more berries. I should, I should stick those in here. Uh, we have lots to cook with at the moment, which is nice. Uh, I want to go and turn in... Turn in this thing. So we'll get uh, ten oinks for that. And then we need to go find the banker. He's the guy that's going to buy all these gems. Uh, and actually, the banker's right over here. Conveniently located right across the road from my base, which is amazing. We're going to start cashing in gems on him. It's going to take a while. All right, we've cashed in all of those. And I'd say we're doing pretty good. 960 oinks right there. 
971. And I think we still have some back of the house, too. I should buy some of these 100-piece coins. It's going to take a little bit. Oh, come on. You're closed for the night? Really? All right. Well, we'll, we'll hold on to a couple of them, I guess. That's pretty cool. Man, we're rich. Okay, we don't really have to worry about uh, about spending money anymore, I don't think. At this point, we're pretty much... Oh, there's more gems. Oh, my gosh. I forgot I had those sitting there. Oh, I did have all the oinks on me. So, we're pretty much... Well, there's... Uh, there's 770 oinks. Another 200, so there's 970. 971 oinks we have on us. That's not bad. And I have three more gems for another 30... So we have basically a thousand oinks. Man, we could shop for days. Well, since it is the hay fever season, I probably should make some nettle rolls, just so we have those handy. Um, now, fortunately, while we're back here at the base, I can just turn on the fan, and that will clear out the hay fever for me. Uh, I have enough, basically, for three nettle rolls. Which isn't great, but it's better than what I had last, last time we ran into the season. Uh, oh, man, I ran out of my lightning power, too. Just as well, my weapons broke since I had to come back. Would have been much more of a pain to run all the way back without, uh, without any lightning charge. Man, that's pretty sweet. Okay, so the plan now is really just to try and, and build some more of those, uh, some more of the pig houses. Or the, the pig vendors, anyway. Uh, so we can basically just do, like, shopping. So I can just pop in. Uh, if I can get a couple of these Oddities Emporiums, it'd be nice to be able to kind of jump in and out of them to try and find gears, just like this one here. Uh, we'll go next door, see if they have any more cutlasses in here. They do! Sweet! Uh, I should actually go into the, the general shop. I'm going to grab a, a few oinks. Man, I'm running so slowly now. I'm so used to being all charged up and running like crazy. Uh, let's grab grab these oinks, I guess. We'll pop into here. I want to see if they have a, uh, a bird trap. They don't, of course. Uh, I could use some flint, though, so we'll buy that. It's only one oink. We've got oinks to spare now. We could start wasting them or something. Uh, I need to get some more nettles. All right, so... I want to get my hands on a bird trap. Um, I, I think it's in the general shop. I, I don't think you can get them anywhere else. Uh, I probably should buy some ice here while I'm at it. Make some sanity drinks and stuff. Oh, speaking of sanity, actually, we can buy, uh, buy the bananas up there. Make some frozen banana pops. Actually, the traps are in here. I think I need to get the bird trap in the weapon shop, not in the general shop. Uh, so we'll throw this down. Oh, we're starting to run into the hay fever. So let's go turn on the fan. Save ourselves a little bit of a little bit of hay fever issues. So that should save me a fair amount in terms of like nether roll usage and stuff by being able to just come back to my base and then not having to worry about the uh, the hay fever anymore. So I think what I'm going to do is uh, next next time I'm going to focus on trying to build some more of the shops. Uh, so we have the way to a way to kind of do some shopping around and stuff. Uh, I do need to get some more nettles, so we'll go ahead and check out those. But uh, today I think was a pretty successful trip. We're fairly fairly set off for money now. I should use up some of that, cook up some of that food before it goes bad on me. But look at that, almost a thousand oinks in like no time flat. Thanks so much for coming to check out the video. When we come back next time, as I said, we're going to work on uh, building some more shops. I'm going to build a bird cage finally. I've been meaning to do one for ages. I really should try to get around to it. Uh, and I also need to get struck by lightning again, because I hate being slow. I'm, as always, Cryptic Fox. I'll see all of you next time.